Welcome to Fort George. This place is a powder keg <laughs> of excitement. That didn't seem convincing. <laughs> Fort George was the headquarters of the British Army during the War of 1812. It was built between 1796 and 1802 to defend Upper Canada. We actually visited in 2017 during the Canada 150 celebrations. But with most Canadians being stuck at home this summer, we thought, what better time is there to promote tourism in our own backyard? On December 10, 1813, American troops burned the town of Niagara to the ground. Families were forced to shelter in the forest in the dead of winter. In retaliation, British forces crossed the Niagara River and captured Fort Niagara, setting fire to American towns between Niagara and Buffalo. The War of 1812 broke out due to many issues between the Americans and the British forces. Trade disputes had grown during the Napoleonic Wars, and the Royal Navy had been stopping and seizing American ships. The British were also allied with some First Nations tribes that were preventing the U.S. from expanding westward. Ultimately, Britain wanted to keep its grasp on colonial Canada. It's pretty neat. It's funny how little I remember from like going to the forts on childhood trips. Certainly appreciate it more now.
bad it's powder and not wine, because that would be even cooler. Welcome to Fort George. This place is a powder <laughs> of excitement. That didn't seem convincing. <laughs> about the more of 18 fall? Uh, what I read on some um, plaques. Yeah. I like that it warns you that you're tall. Yeah. In uh, 1812, everyone was short. <laughs> I guess so you can fire down. Fire in the hole. <laughs> Make sure that we don't get locked out because we can't get back. It locks behind us. Yeah, I don't think we're strong enough to open that. I don't want to chuck it. Just jump it. Easy peasy. You can see a harbor and you can see uh, the, the American side of the water through here. Yeah. Yeah, I guess if they're on the top floor and they can open up those little things to shoot down. Yeah. If anyone's trying to get to the tunnel or whatever. Fortified. Yeah. It's kind of why it's called a fort. Like a fort. <laughs> Beautiful blue sky above you, oh my goodness. Let's go fire some cannons. Oh, there aren't any cannons in this one. <laughs> is doing so well after being here for nearly 200 years. Yeah. Tin cans of cardboard boxes. Food was stored in barrels. That makes sense. Preservation purposes. Food was smoked, dried, salted, or pickled. Alcoholic beverages were stored in barrels, glass or clay bottles, and in cakes. Oh, it smells good. Like they've had a fire. It smells like campfire. Cool. I wish you could smell this. It smells good.
tiny bed though. I don't think it fit. That's, in, that's totally in regard to their height. where the inspiration for the Muppets came from. Little known fact. There's a little guy in there. Are you a mutineer? Mutiny, mutiny. That's what jail looks like. Behind bars. Ah. Yeah, there's bars here too. Probably nervous about living there. It would hurt if you fell on those spikes. Here, I'll leave that, yeah. It's pretty cool. Wait, can you see Fort Niagara? Oh, Niagara. The sworn enemy. The Klingons are coming. 